Hey, shalom, shalom, shalom. Hey, first and foremost, we would love to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahushai, Bahashem, Makakadash. Hey, give all honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, who will, and uh, blessings and uh, you know, safe, uh, safety to the Akim out there, your sisters, and your families out there who believe on the name Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahushai, truth and sincerity. You know, living in these perilous times, man. So you want to say shalom. All right, and uh, you know, hey, man, we the brothers. Represent the Great Millstone Camp in uh, Cleveland. Uh, Y'all here with the Akim out here in Atlanta, uh, GMS Atlanta. Hey, Lord willing, this lesson is edified to a home for a living, man. All right? And, uh, you know, basically, man, this, uh, the name of this uh, uh, lesson is uh, our, our people worship the Lord in the air. All right? Because, hey, man, you got two thirds of our people, man. Hey, man, I've been, Apostle Horror always said, too, man, Christianity, uh, Christianity is the worst the drug ever, man. That's right. You know, you want to know, you talk about how many, you know, uh, drugs. Uh, crack cocaine destroyed our people, you know, and uh, you know, cocaine and all these different other uh, drugs, man. But no, man, Christianity destroyed uh, uh, our whole damn nation down there, man. Okay, and if it wasn't for your how about you, Shah having a uh, small remnant, man, you know, man, the whole nation would be destroyed, man. Yeah, it's, all right, it's, 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 that's right, brother. Man. All right, so uh, yeah, you know, you know, two thirds of our people, they you know, they worshiping, uh, you know, these different idols, man. You know, believing that they're the uh, true uh, power of the planet Earth, man. You know, and you know, in order to you know, first and foremost, worship the Lord, man, you have to you have to know the name of the Lord, man, him and his son, man. You can't. How could you worship them and truth and sincerity without knowing the name, man? So I want the brother open up with that proverb. Okay, this is the book of Proverbs, chapter thirty, verse four. Who hath ascended into heaven, or descended? Who hath gathered the wind in his fence? Who hath bound the waters in the garden? Right, and uh, like two, uh, two thirds of our people, man, they. they Give that credit to uh, to other uh, false false idols, man. You know, when hey man, when a uh, when a building get knocked down, like just a, a prime example, man, that building just collapsed in uh, South Florida, I believe, man. You know, or or when a storm come through and rip houses apart, man, they give that credit to Mother Nature, man. All right, they don't give the Lord uh, his due respect, man. Okay, they, you know they put the Lord in a box, man. Okay, but then they you know give all the uh, honor and glory to, uh, to 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 nonsense, man. Okay. Y'all gonna be destroyed for that, man. All right. Not only, not only that, they don't really true care to risk the Lord. That's what right. they're saying. In fact, they don't know you how about Shimon Shah, man. That's why they don't understand his characteristics. They don't understand the Lord does good and evil, man. Scripture tells you, surely the Lord is a God that judges from the earth. That's so right. we see those different things like in Florida, that's judgment, man. Right. Our people, they don't know the Lord, so they don't associate that with the most high, the heavenly father and the son, man. Right. They, they associate with the Satan did that. Or whatever I said, but I said, like Mother Nature, man. Mm -hmm. No, I would make that point. Like, our people don't know the Lord, man. There's no means to be acquainted. Yeah, right, exactly. Right. Man. right. They so, yeah. But they think that the Lord's high just sit in the heavens, like, okay, well, that's all good. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. All exactly. Good. At the right. end of the day, I'm just going to save everyone. We're going to hold yeah. our hands and walk through the kids. Our people think the most high suit, man. The most high, the scriptures tell you, is an austere power. Him and his son, man. Okay, they rule the earth, but the scriptures tell you, he rule the, uh, the earth with uh, the palm of his hand, all the people. Slot you, he uh, will the earth to call his hand all things obey his will, man. Right. The Lord is not a joke, not a game to play with, man. The Lord is very, very serious. He takes his laws and his, his, his what he commands you to do, very, very serious, man. There's serious consequences when you don't follow that law, that that, that standard he has put in the earth, man. Uh, so, man. Who hath established all the things of the earth? What is his name and what is his son's name? Mm -hmm. and Oh, that's a rhetorical question, man. Right. Okay, because you got, uh, I, I believe the last time I looked it up, man, it was over, well, damn near 3 billion uh, Christians in the world, man. Yeah. Hey, you know, and a majority of that number are Israelites, man. Okay, but hey, if you you people calling on God and Jesus Christ, man, if, if that's if that if that was the, uh, the true name of the Heavenly Father, why would the Lord ask that question? Okay, because this name has to be given to you, man. Uh, there's no uh, other name other than the Son given among men, which, which we... We may be, must be saved, but we're paraphrasing, man. Okay? So the name of the Lord is not God and Jesus, man. It's not Allah. It's not Buddha. It's not Yahweh. It's not Yahshua, man. Right. All right? Right. You look at the works of those people who call those names. There's nothing but wickedness, man. Right. All the people who call them so-called Jesus, like Buddha said, Yahweh, Yeshua, all the other nonsense, man. They they, they don't follow the laws and commandments. They don't exalt no. the righteous ways of the Lord, man. They don't even care about the Lord. They're not thinking about the Lord. Okay, whenever they get a... Uh, a blessing or something, they may post a post on Instagram talking about no God looking out or God bless or God bless me, whatever, but they don't really consider the ways of the Lord. It's just to tell you it's all about living knowledge, man. Okay, they don't they don't consider their their behavior from day to day, okay, how they, they operate their behavior and is this pleasing to the most high, man. Hey, but don't be the same 
people in the trees decided to let it fall inside the saddle. Right. We put back in the sand. People in the trees are long man. You feel me? You mm -hmm. don't have to keep the laws no more. <laughs> they, don't even, they don't even put the law at the forefront of life, man. Okay. Right. They, they use the law as, as like a, uh, it's like it's like a gimmick to them or something that's like a, a side thing, man. No, like like a little like a. I don't know what call it. You understand what I'm saying? It's not the main part of their life. They don't even take it seriously, man. Right. Well, I got something. Yeah. This uh, Isaiah 31. Woe to the rebellious children, said the Howl of Hashem the shot that take counsel but not of me. And that add the covering with the covering, but not of my spirit, that they may not sin to sin. Because they can do the wrong spirit. It's coming from the spirit of JC, and I don't want to say those names. You know, they, it's coming from the names of Allah and Buddha and nigga woman, and coming in, in the spirit of money, and you feel me, long time, and you feel me. Now those, those leads to the worst of darkness, man. Okay, right. again, wickedness, unfruitful. Okay, death. Ultimately, that's what the so-called black culture is amongst our people, man. Death. Okay, we were just talking off camera about the, all the different little shootings that Jay be doing to each other all the time. Man. That's normal, man. Okay, even me growing up before I knew the truth or anything, like, I'm unfazed. I'm desensitized to Jay killing each other, man. That's, that's just normal, man. That's just an average every day. Um, you can lose alert about, you know, Jay you know, shooting each other up, you know, so-called drive-bys, etc. That's the worst of darkness. All these same people who, again, will go through all their life, do all this wickedness, but then they shout to God, and God's, God's my rock right, right there, right, right, right. So again, with what, that, and that good God, again, it's just to tell you what the God's name, the Lord's name, but the paraphrasing, so if you got to actually get it, you're going to mention about that name, man. Okay, how about Shemir you know, you come in that name, your behavior will reflect on it, because you understand, again, the characteristics of the Lord, okay, the, the consequences for your actions, okay, you're going to live with the fear of how about Shemir you know, man, that's not going to be talk, man. No? That's right, because... And like ultimately, our people was worshiping Esau, man. Uh, yeah. And the scriptures say that ye are your father devil, and unless there you would do. Esau, everything that Esau all oh, lust is for our people to do, our people out here doing, man. All right? But yeah, my brother want to grab that John. John. Yeah, John 4 22. Because, because in order to worship someone, you have to first you have to know who they are, man. That's right. You no? Know? So hey man, you know, brother got that? Yeah, it's uh, John chapter 4 and verse uh, 22. They worship, they know not what. Right, our people out here worshiping, they don't even got a clue what it is, man. Yeah. You know, our people can be uh, worshiping corn. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Our people don't got, they don't, they don't got a clue, man. Yeah, I mean, even with these so called yeah. pagan holidays, et cetera, that Esau sets up for them, they don't really know what it goes back to, man. Yeah, they don't understand, right. like, things like Christmas, et cetera, goes back to you know, things like Nimrod and idolatry. They just worship it, they don't know what they worship, man. They, 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 they partake in it. Well, Esau, this is the. This is the, the so-called conclusion. That's what everyone in this empire does. I was going to do it too, man. That's right. why they look at you crazy if you don't celebrate with them. You know? Hey, he's like, God. Okay, that's what I'm saying. That's the spirit. That's what people say. Uh, what they say? The um, simple believer every word. Uh, uh, Prove the man of the world to the thorns. Like you said, with these holidays, it's only a Google search away. Sure. We'll find out what, you know, Christmas is and Halloween yeah. and Thanksgiving. Yeah. You know, everybody got a smartphone. We just look it up and see what it's really about, but... Hey, you say the simple pass on the punish, man. You yeah. know? Even with things like Thanksgiving, they said that, man. Hey, that information is widely spread. That's right. Not only starting with the first, you know, starting with the Paul Sanders, Big Millstone, mm -hmm. brothers on down, bringing out the information. Every single year, the brothers always do what we call it with Thanksgiving, the brothers doing the breakdown, breaking it down. See, now we're in a time where and there's going to be no excuse, man. What well, how shall I say, if I had not come onto them, they had not sinned, but now they have no clothes for this sin. Because see, the information is here now. But now we probably now, majority of our people just don't care. They don't care. Oh, uh, with these uh, these these uh these pagan holidays, etc. It's idolatry goes back to that. They just want to worship it. And it's it's black goes out, and they're like a the little kid putting their head, uh, the hands, and he was like this, saying la 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 la. They don't, they don't care. Jake, no, Jake, no. These some of these holidays go back to Jake. Yeah. Just in the, I gotta do it for the kids. Yeah, right. You know what I'm saying? I gotta do it for the kids, man. A lot of these people gonna be put to death just for your kids, man. Right. I gotta, I don't put my kid, man. They, they, they have a day, man. You know, but, you know, but, brother, finish that. Yeah. It's uh, John chapter 4, verse 22. They worship, they know not what. Hey, because these things that Jake worshiping, these these things ain't never pulled through for you before, man. The Lord delivered us from the land of Eve and the Lord and came through for our nation, man, in all type of ways, man, you know? And these things are for things that our people worship and they ain't never showed up for you, man. Right. You know? Says we know what we worship. Yeah, we know what we worship, man. We worship the God of the Bible, man. Yahweh. 
And his son's name is Yahweh Shai, man, which is the deliverer, man, which is the one who's going to redeem us out of this fucking captivity. Excuse my language, man. Uh, if I can say something, too, uh, that, that's, when you read that, John the fourth chapter, basically that, that Samaritan woman, she was she was basically delusional. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because she was talking about, yeah, 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 you know what I'm saying? She's like, you know, this is, you know, go back to our forefather Jacob, this is at the well and all that. Then Yahweh Shai had to correct her, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's why that statement that he said right there, that's what we're going to. Because that was, that Samaritan woman was a heathen. It says, uh, "We we know what we worship. For salvation is of the Jews." Yeah. So that and that, that that also goes into you know what I mean another cut because that doctrine is out there. Well, that, that 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 doctrine is out there as well. Talking about everybody can be saved, man. Yeah. Y'all shot clearly said salvation is of the Jews. Yeah, distinction like yeah, 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 right. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like it's a, it's a separation. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah, right. you got to you say, no, 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 no. Oh, Thank you up, Holy Spirit. Yeah. 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 You see it too, cause see, yeah. brothers like and that's not a boast to ourselves. We're saying this all glory to how about Shimon and Shabbat. This is what brothers live for. Like this right. brothers, bro. Starting the past illustrate real stone. We are always meditate on this truth. We always meditate on how about Shimon and Shabbat. This this is our focal point, man. Yeah. We got people. Our people love to have the Instagram bio, the high first, etc. But no, do your actions really reflect what's coming out of your mouth, man? We brothers actually really do that. Really, everything we think of is think about the raised level of our nation, man. Okay. Uh, Bring our people back to righteousness. Okay, you trim your own land things that you gotta work on your own personal work, man. Okay, your behavior, you know, our people, they'll be wicked as hell, but then they talk about glory to God. It's like you 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 but you contradict everything in the scripture. That's okay. Matthew 15 and 8. This people draw up nigh unto me with their mouth and honor me with their lips, but their heart is far from me. Hey. Stop it. Stop. 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 It's uh Matthew uh 15 and 7. So when he said truly Isaiah, he said truly um, Isaiah said. I was just saying, uh, eight. Yeah, matter of fact, read, uh, yeah, read, read, read about seven. Yeah. It's Isaiah, I mean, it's Matthew 15 and 7. Ye hypocrites yeah. did, well, did Isaiah's prophesy yeah, that, that, of him saying, right? Because you know, how was quoting Isaiah. You know, right. read the book of Isaiah, that's basically where you're getting at. Read, read that back again. All right, Matthew 15 and 7. Ye yeah. hypocrites, well, did Isaiah prophesy of you saying, this people draw night unto me with their mouth and honor of me with their lips, but their heart is far from me. Yeah, you know what I mean? So that's that's something that every prophet they did, they, they basically reiterated, you know what I mean, each other, you know, especially like the prophets of old, you know what I'm saying? Like Jeremiah, Isaiah, like those prophets, they had a they had a lot of uh, right. things that was spoken about that like Paul and like the, uh, mm -hmm. the disciples had quoted, even how shot himself. He just he just spoke about uh, the things that, that Isaiah witnessed when he was walking around, man. That's right. These dark people, man, they are they're very hypocritical, man. Mm -hmm. They got a lot of lip service and all they do, they like to talk about God, God this, God that, but they actually don't show for Bible them. versus license plates. Yeah, bro, they <laughs> have like, Jesus. Yeah. You know what I mean? I love Jesus, bison tags, and then that. What Jesus do? Yeah, yeah, man. Like, bro, that the Jesus Lord don't God. <laughs> God. The Lord don't care about that, man. He, he wants to see actions displayed, man. Scripture say, uh, don't be a hero of the word, but be yeah. a doer. Right? Yeah, bro. All right. I got the account that uh, Matthew is quoting. Yes. Uh, Isaiah 29 and 13. Wherefore, Yahweh Rashi said, For as much as this people draw near me with their mouth yep. and with their lips, do honor me. But have removed their heart from from me, yep. and their fear towards me is taught by the precepts of men. Right, because hey, in, uh, in the church houses, man, they, they they tell you that the law is done away with. Okay, that uh, the Lord, the house shot. Well, they don't say the house shot first and foremost, but they say that uh, JC he died for the sins that you committed then, the sins you committed now, and the sins you're gonna commit in the future. Mm -hmm. Which putting our people in that spirit of just just doing complete wickedness, man. You know, the law is done. Away with it, then soon as Jake get his head bust, everybody crying and complaining and asking God why. Yeah. But no one told him not to be a mower. No one told him that it was wrong to be dealing with another man woman. Yeah. As soon as the judge would come on him, oh, wow, hey. yeah. 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 he took care of his family. But what about the laws of the Bible, man? Yeah. They don't want to hear that, man. When you tell them, like, even we had a situation recently with my family members, maybe they had a family member pass away or whatever. And I don't even know, I'm cool. I understand, yeah. like, we. We have the Lord give, give us understanding with his word, but that's why again with Isaiah 33 and 6, the wisdom and knowledge of his severe thy time, thy time to the salvation and fear of the voice of church. So we, we understand things, man. Okay, why? Because the Lord has had everything broken down in the scriptures, man. Our family members basically, you know, 
fan base was saying the why God would do this, why he would do this on his head. But I can, if I can really break it down and tell you exactly why, look, he's doing this, he's doing this, this. but Jake don't hear that. Right, that's all for you, bro. Yeah, Proverbs 28 and 5. Evil man understand not judgment, uh, but they that seek the Lord understand all things. Uh, well, that's good. And what is evil, man? Evil is, is all the things that are contrary to how will I see how shot, man. That's, that, that's what evil is. Everything is evil when he did righteousness. Man. And that's perfect, and that's why I'm exactly why I'm right here, because I just said what? Evil is everything contrary to how about she all shot what he did was right, right? This uh Romans chapter 10 and verse 1. Brethren, my heart's desire and prayer to the most high for Israel is that they might be saved. And you see that he did say the whole world. He said, I pray for Israel, his people. When you go to I think that's Romans 9, right? My uh according to the flesh. Verse 2, for I bear them record that they have a zeal of the Most High, but not according to knowledge. Yeah, our people got a zeal, okay? Because our people got a, a spiritual attachment to the Heavenly Father, right? But according to the knowledge is because they're being taught by men, man. And again, they're getting taught uh, the, the, the doctrine of Esau. So they think they know, say, I was just talking about these Christians, think they, they know it all, man. You know, but you get in, the Holy Spirit is not dead. Hey, that's why we're the pastor in a damn church. You got to bring out a damn choir, you got to bring out a step team. Yeah. Because the spirit not dealing with them. You got to go back to the back and try to put something together and take a little break. No, man. You know, the spirit is not dealing with you, man. So, yeah, our people got that zeal, okay, that spiritual connection. But according to knowledge, our people done, man. And that's why our people out here getting their head cracked. Because the scriptures say what, man? Uh, my people are destroyed for the lack of knowledge, man. Because the true knowledge is the knowledge of the Bible, man. All right, the wisdom of this world is foolish with the most high, man. And our people, vocab, all you, not here, our people, but vocab, uh, you, you know, other ABC Israelite camps out there, man, you full of knowledge of this world, man. Okay, but yeah, go ahead and get in there, brother. I know the brother has some little quick. Verse three, for they, for they being ignorant of the most high's righteousness. In darkness, all right, being ignorant means you're, you're in darkness. Ultimately, man, the Lord have covered your eyes, man. All right, you're not worthy of this wisdom, knowledge, uh, uh, of the scriptures, man. Okay, so you covered you in darkness, man. Okay, it says for they being ignorant of the Most High's righteousness and going about to establish their own righteousness have not submitted themselves unto the righteousness hey, of the Most High. Now that's a perfect scripture, man. Jake think she Jake think helping the old lady across the street is righteous, man. Yeah. This damn woman going to church, man. Yeah. Uh, she got a damn uh, a pork sausage sandwich in her bag, man. Okay, Jake, they ought to have a homeboy, man, just buy him out, man, you know, pay his rent like he was locked. But he bought him out to come out here and sell some drugs, man. Amen. All right, that's why the scriptures say what, man? There are ways we seem to bring unto a man, but at the end of the realm, there are the ways of death. All this, all this, uh, this stuff that you think is righteous in the eyes of the Lord, man, you're going to be put to death for it, man. That's why the Lord set up prophets, man. All right, to direct you, the scriptures say, uh, cry aloud, spare not, lift up. Uh, your voice as a trumpet show my people they transgressions in the house of Jacob their sins. We're showing them who your transgressions. We're we, we telling you right from wrong, man. But you people want, man. The scriptures say they want to hear smooth words. They say, speak, don't speak unto me right things. We let you know our people know what we're saying is right. Okay, speak unto us smooth things. Jake want to be rocked to sleep, man. Okay? Hey, I was going to grab make the point real quick. I read in here in Romans 10 and 3 it said he established his own righteousness. Hey, Jake, what's righteous to Jake is doing a bunch of wickedness. Then you get caught in the Esau system and so called not snitching, man. That's like the, that's like the top of so called Israelite men in the world. I didn't snitch. I, I took the time, man. That's righteousness. That's against the Bible. Right? Yeah, that, 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 that's the burden of judgment, man. You, you're not supposed to uh, suffer your own people to be evil, man. You're supposed to rebuke them before they even got left up. They was doing all that wickedness. You're supposed to rebuke them and tell them they were going off, man. Yeah, yeah, man. So real quick, uh, just back y'all up. It's um Jeremiah four and twenty two. Uh, it says, "For my people is foolish; they have not known me. They are saddest children." Hey, and that's yep. what your brother opened up with. They have not known me. They don't know the Lord because they foolish, man. Right. The Lord loves his love of him that dwell with uh, our people. Don't have it, man. That's right. It says, "And they have none understanding." I don't understand, man. Wisdom is the principal thing, but with all that getting, get to understand. Yeah, the reason why our people they, they don't they don't know the Lord and they don't have understanding is because they're giving the prophets a stiff arm, man. Mm -hmm. All right, they see the prophets out there on the highways and hedges, they use that time to scoff. Mm -hmm. You know, they, they see the, the they see the prophet go on a live stream. Hey, start once again, start with, I start with the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, who is the leaders of Israel, 
Israel today, man. You know, hey, you know, you, you see them great men. You know, you, you choose that. You choose to uh, watch their video to uh, to hear something that you don't like to, to try to speak about to get some damn YouTube uh, uh, views, man. Okay, you gonna be put to death, man. All right, go ahead, brother. Yep. Get in there, brother. Yeah, it says, <laughs> it says they are wise to do evil, but to do good, they have no knowledge. You know. Yeah, and that's that's Jake, man. You know, when it comes to uh, you know wickedness and evil, Jake is a goddamn mastermind. Man. <laughs> you know, Jake is a fucking you know, Jake is a top Harvard scholar when it comes to wickedness and evil. When it comes to doing something righteous and serving the Lord the proper way, Jake is like brother said, they, they don't have that understanding, man. Right. Hey, you know, Jake is yeah. sitting in jail, <laughs> thinking about ways not to get caught at doing something wicked besides just putting the wickedness down. Right. right. Ain't quite got to worry about it. Well, this time when I get out, I'm gonna keep the work in my ass. <laughs> Come on, Jake, man. That's the spirit of Esau. That's how Esau yeah. moved. Yeah. You know, that's right. Yeah. Can't deceive the Lord, man. The true God of the Bible, you know, you can't. He, he can't be deceived, man. Okay. Five hundred pounds in parts, baby. Son of the good enemy. Uh, yeah, yeah, uh, this is the book of Malachi, chapter uh, 1, verse 6. It says, A son honored his father, and a servant his master. If then I be a father, where is my honor? And if I be a master, where is my fear? All right, so y'all giving, giving it to uh, these false idols, man. You're not giving it to your high boss, we always shot, man. The one who, hey, the, hey, the little scripture say they have received benefits and have not known me, man. Here it is, man. The Lord, hey, you know, you know, the Lord has, man, looked out for Jake, man. Jake's living good, man. You know, Jake is living good, man. But guess what, man? You know, they they not giving no uh, honor to your high boss, Shimmy Shah, man. Can I say one thing real quick? Is the fact that you know, the brother just read the fact that you know, it's the Lord's master and father. Where's his spirit? Here it is. And Jake's speeding on the highway or whatever, and you see a cop. Jake will hit the brakes and slow down, but yet. You don't keep that same energy with the Lord, man. Exactly. You used to do all this wickedness, yeah, and you have the yeah. problem out here warning you to chill out and stop and look, return to the Lord. The Lord's about to be in judgment. And Jake, he hit the gas harder, man. Yeah. And he was Jesus scoffing, laughing. Like, I mean, and who will pull me over? That's basically what Jake is in the spirit of, man. And you know? the scripture says, for not the one that can kill the body, but the one that can kill the body and the spirit. The Lord is the father of spirits here, man. And ultimately, man, it's, it, you know, cutting the middle man out, man. You get straight to the source. The source is the Lord, man. He saw who. Oh, and the scriptures say, man, the Lord controlled the minds, man. Yeah. You know? Hey, like, like, brother, like a brother, and I can't always say this This world teaches you to fear Satan. Uh, they don't teach you to fear the heaven. Like, when Jake comes down, I'm down, I'm down, I'm down, I'm down, you know, so I'm not going to come to, you know, God, so to speak, but after they fall, uh, you know, they, they real passive. You know, like, treat, you know, treat the most high like crap, man. You know? And that's the spirit. And see, the reason why we can you know, reiterate these points is the fact that we were in that darkness, man. That's we're right. not here to be so called holy, but now it's that's the right. fact that we used to be there. I remember, like, brothers made mention of the fact about the spirit of Satan. I remember, you know, watching the Lord when we were set up with the demons and shit. Yeah. I used to be shook about that. But right. see, once it comes to the understanding, you understand the right the right hand is way more scary mm -hmm. than, than the left hand, man. Because so how about seeing our shot control is both? That's right. So, that's, that's, that's again, the brother that quoted, I'll tell you what, how was shot said, I'll tell you more who you should fear, man. And that's crazy because yeah. the church that teach you that the Lord and Satan is beefing, yeah, and, you know, yeah, all yeah, this yeah. and that. And but when you read the book of Job, man, say the Lord, hey, where you come from, man? You know, yeah. say from back and forth, hey, you ask with him, hey, man, you ain't fucking Christians, man. The Lord will snap you on next, man. Yeah, man, did not the devil beg you how I would beseech you, you know, the, 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 the Send us into the pigs and the dig them, man. You come to torment us for a time. Yeah, they were shooting. They were shooting. I was shot, man. This is uh, Psalm chapter. I'm all swinging. Psalm 34 and 11. It says, Come ye, come ye children, hearken unto me. I will teach you the fear of the Lord, man. And that's ultimately our job, man. Because, you know, you might have this, like, the war past the camp and stuff like that. And we, you know, we hear it all the time or like, from time to time. We're like, Why y'all out here? Uh, what's the purpose of y'all being out here? It's to teach you the fear of the Lord. Because Jake don't understand that your actions do require, you know what I'm saying, you to fear the Heavenly Father. Right. You can't just walk around earth doing whatever the hell you want to do, man. That's right. It's countless scriptures on how the Lord gave him his life. The scriptures say, the scriptures talk about how you were, um, you were bought, uh, you were bought with Christ, you know what I'm saying? And the, the price is that the blood of Yahweh Shah, he died for you to not live like a brute beast, man. Right. You know what I mean? You can't just walk around doing, you know, 
whatever the hell you want right. to do, man. That means the Lord died in vain. That's right. That's right. I just want to real quickly slide in there. It's uh, this is rock one and eight. There is one wise and greatly oh, to be feared. Yeah. The Lord sitting upon his throne. That, and that's the heavenly father and son, man. Y'all about your mouth shot. They, they greatly to be feared, man. You know what I'm saying? Because the brother quoted earlier in Matthew 10, you know what I'm saying, where it talks about the uh, fear of him that uh, killed God. That's it, yeah, that's, that's, the, that's, the, that's it, man. You can't. You can't uh, treat the heavenly father like you know, like he's just your homeboy or something like that. Right, right, you know what I'm right. saying? Y'all got it, man. But Jake, Jake treat the most high like a genie in the Bible. Yeah, like yeah, yeah. yeah. So now I need, I'm calling you know, get my three wishes. Right. All right, you know, that's back. You know, like, nah, man. Get the most high text, man. Yeah, yeah. It's like, y'all what's that? Yeah. Uh, yeah. What you done? You done? Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna finish. Yeah, I'm looking at the first step right now. But like I said, for this nation, they mission on the fact that we fear the Lord. Hey, uh, hey, our people get they all free. And they, they, they feel like so they're not getting judged right now, and they, they'll never have to worry about it, man. If I want to grab this priest, I can tell you about that. Uh, I, I, I can go back to this real quick. This is what uh, I got right here. This is a uh, uh, Sirach chapter 1 and verse 13. It says, Whoso feareth the Lord, it shall go well with him at the last, he shall, shall find favor in the day of his death, man. Okay, and that's like, that's like, that's a long one. Like, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know uh, uh, easy man, rewarded, rewarded man, and they were dead. Quarter, quarter, little one. Yeah, but yeah, like uh, we were going into, man, our people is, our people is, is, is done for, man, you know? You know, giving, you know, that's like a slap in the face to the Lord, man. The Lord, you know, delivered us from the land of Egypt, man. And he's on his way to deliver us from the hands of these Edomites, man. They all just still don't get it, man. You know, you, you had, hey, man, our people been worshiping JC this whole captivity, and nothing has changed, man. It's like all people think they go, now all people, you know, worshiping uh, Money Bad Joe, man. You know, because it's a damn stimulus checks, man. All people just don't get it, man. Yeah, this uh, it's like that got found because I looked at the Sirach chapter 11, verse 25. In the day of prosperity, there's forgetfulness of affliction. In the day of affliction, there's a there's no remembrance of prosperity, man. Okay, they saw all this wickedness our people are doing. They've been boasting it, proud of people who talk about off camera, the sidelines, etc. Yeah. They proud, man. Man, they, they wear that pride, man. Hey, this is first of my neighborhood got that pride thing wearing proud. Yeah. They're gonna tell me something about that, man. Yeah. But guess what? The day of affliction, and you gonna, you gonna forget all about the way you was living it up, man. Okay, all the way you was enjoying the, the, the pleasure, like just tell you what the pleasure is set for a season, man. Verse uh verse 26, it says, For it's for it's an easy thing unto the Lord in the day of death to award a man according to his ways. The affliction of an hour maketh the man forget pleasure. And in his end, his deeds shall be discovered, man. So again, this is why you should fear the Lord. How about shin y'all shot, man? The Lord got everything. There's nothing that goes on the Lord didn't see, man. No wickedness you, you thought you got away with. Man, the brother quoted, what, uh, the eyes of the Lord is 10 down times brighter than the sun, man. So the Lord sees all that, man. The Lord is sitting there, and the Lord is going to give a, a, a proper judgment in due time. He sees fit. So it, 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 will, it will behoove you. In this grace period, for you to repent to the Lord, humble yourself, and try to, uh, uh, excuse me, tell you, boldly approach, approach the uh, throne of grace, man. True okay. God in the Bible. Yeah. Are you asking, brother? Yep. This is uh, 1 Chronicles 16 and 23. It says, Sing unto the Lord, your heart about me on the shy. All the earth shall forth from day to day his salvation, declare his glory among the heathen, his marvelous works among all nations, but that's what we're doing. You know, that's why the spirits of my brothers to, to actually bring this out because we're declaring the glory of the Lord, his his worthiness to be praised, period, uh, all of that. Uh, right? This verse 25, for great is the Lord, Yahweh Shai, and greatly to be praised, he also is to be feared above all gods. So above everything, like the brother was mentioning about what our people do now, where it's been Jay-Z or Kanye or these different celebrities and artists, these our condition has not changed. Right, right. So what power do they really have? So when it comes down to, to really worshiping something, even going back with these churches, we actually know and understand that we have to fear the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, and His Son, Yahweh Shai, because He's above everything. He created all of this. Uh, you know? Why well, God bring this time? It's because, hey, man, all you, uh, you know, you people out there that's, you know, giving the Lord's glory over to these false idols, man, you're going to have to depend on these false idols in the time of Jacob's trouble, man. Okay? You're going to get the same results, okay? This is uh, Judges 10 and 13. 
Yet ye have forsaken me and served other gods. Wherefore I will deliver you no more. Go and cry unto the gods which ye have chosen, and let them deliver you in the time of your tribulation, man. So, hey, man, when all hell break loose, man, you have to call little JC, man. You have to uh, uh, sing a uh, uh, cry to a deaf ear, man. Okay, you have to pray to that Buddha statue you had sitting over there in the corner of your house, man. You are, you are, hey, and the scripture say money delivered out in uh, the time of what? Uh, uh, Rich is paraphrasing. Riches profit not. Riches profit not in the day of wrath. Right. Righteous delivered from death, man. So, hey, man, the money, Floyd Mayweather, man, you showing a million dollars, a million dollars. None of that is going to deliver you in the time of tribulation, man. In the time of the Lord's wrath, man. Go ahead, real quick. Go back to this um, book of Hosea 5 and um, 15. I will go and return to my place to they acknowledge their offense and, uh, and seek my face. In their affliction, they will seek me early. Just like, like Jake. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. So, yeah. They fucked up by hopping the Jack and Jack and Free. Oh, damn, God. Help me out of this, and I promise I won't do it no more. <laughs> That's right. As soon as Jake gets out of the situation, they back to doing the bullshit, bro. That's right. Yeah, so when all, all hell and the fix come up, like it says in Proverbs 1. Oh, yeah. You know, the time of the calamity, the Lord say you're going to laugh. So, you know, a lot of Jake's heard the name of the Lord. They don't try to call on Lord ain't going to hear you. A lot of Jake's know they're scared. Yep, yeah. This whole time has been, you know, basically, you know, shucking and jiving, man. You know how many times we say the name of the Lord, man? That's yeah. right. You know, on our videos or in front of our family. So they know it. They remember that name. You know, Jake like to have some shit in the cut just in case. Mm -hmm. you know, just in case they write, let me write this down. Hey, you know? <laughs> That's one of the names. Suffering on the farm with dude had got pulled over by the cops and he tried that car. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you have a bus? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, I remember that. I'm yeah. still not fucked up. Man. And the scripture say that not really this station say Lord Lord. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 The scripture also say, Why you call me Lord and do not the things that I say? Because our people are really in the spirit of rebellious woman, man. When the scriptures tell you, Jeremiah 6 and 2, man, I have likened the daughter of Zion unto a calmly and delicate woman. Our people, and our people in the spirit of these, these women today talk about like they are walking the house, out the house in the forest apparel. You tell them to put some clothes on, and they will buck up against you, but they sit there telling you, I love you. Yeah. Uh, this is my man, et cetera, et cetera, man. That's the same thing of way our people do with the Lord having lost and the commandments you gotta follow. But then what do our people do? Individuals like little Goosey talking about those and yeah. 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 most high. Yeah. Oh, but yeah. it's important. Yeah. Yeah. It's probably for you, man. The most high, but see, you don't want to follow this law, and you right. go around talking about God, man. So the Lord's gonna deal with all you rebellious things like you you uh what the scripture tell you. Oh, Syria and around my anger, I should see you against a hypocritical nation. That's gonna happen again, man. It happened right. in the past, it's gonna happen again, man. In the time of Jacob's trouble, you know. Right. Time of shovel, I said it never was, man. He saw him by let loose. The Lord has given Esau all this technology, all these laser beams, etc. I seen some other uh, article in the day talking about you know Amalek over there in our land, talking about you can use a, a laser weapon and shit. I'm like, yeah. the Lord got some stuff, gave me yeah. some stuff, man. Yeah. Yeah. And it's to get you rebellious Israelites, man. Because hey, you you disrespect the Lord, man. Y'all, 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 our people, man, they don't even understand how disrespectful it is. Right. The, the, the way they is shunned the Lord, the way he, this is the creator of all things. You don't even understand who you deal with, man. The scriptures tell you what who glory may not be comprehended, man. And the Lord chose us, He put His name on us. Here, the Lord, we're the only nation the Lord is dealing with. And our people are like, eh. And the scriptures say if the Lord would have yeah. chosen them other nations, they would have a listen. Right? Mm -hmm. But see, you better look at the Bible. Go ahead, brother. Get in there. <laughs> I'm gonna continue on where I left off. It's uh, First Chronicles 16 and 26. It says, for all the gods of the people are idols, but Yahweh Bashmiah Washah made the heavens. Yeah. Glory and honor are in his presence. Strength and gladness are in his place. Give unto the Lord, ye kindreds of the people. Give unto the Lord glory and strength. Give unto the Lord, Yahweh Bashmiah Washah, the glory due unto his name. Bring an offering and come before him. Worship the Lord in the beauty of holiness. So there's a glory that comes with the name that we have to, that's due. Sorry. Because exactly what the brother was just saying, just about how the, the the Lord being the creator of all things, the fact that he put his name upon us, that's owed to him. Because that's something that's due from us. Right. Like if you were part of a, a club or a membership or something, you got to pay your dues because of the benefits that you get. Well, that's something that our people have, you know, really shunned off. Right. But we're supposed to actually be making sure we're giving those offerings and those praises and those things too.
because the Lord is benefiting us. Because when the time of trouble comes, we're going to need those benefits. We're going to need that love, we're going to need that compassion, that mercy, That's so right. we can get salvation. Right. But our people don't want our people, you know what? This is what the brother said. They're like, eh, you know, forget that. You know, we'll just take this chip over here. Don't worry about now. Right. right. You know, you know? Those words can't feed my kids. Yeah. You know, yeah. you know, these words in this Bible can't pay my rent. I the Lord understands I gotta do what I gotta do. That's the spirit of what our people in, man. But little do you know that the, the fact that these words written in this book are well, the yeah. reason why you can't feed your kids. Yeah, that's right. Or you can't feed your kids because of the prophecy. That's right. You know? That's right. I got this is uh, verse 29, uh, sorry, 30. It says, Fear before him all the earth, the world also shall be stable, that it be not moved. And what world is going to be stable once it starts to fear the Lord? Starting with Israel. The cosmos. You know? We're, right, the cosmos. We're going to, once we fully embrace the understanding that the Bible is our book and that the, he's not going to teach us the Bible. He taught us, he taught us, uh, 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 he used the Bible, certain certain small three four scriptures, you know, small scriptures, I'm just, you know, exaggerating. He used small scriptures to, to uh, exact his authority over us. Right. But when it comes to the Bible and what it's really about, this is our book. So that's, so us following the book, that was going to make us stable in the times to come. But it, it, it starts with fearing the Lord, knowing what he wants us to do, knowing his will. And keeping it, right. doing it. Right. Hey, right, man, that was it, brother. Hey, yeah. right, so we hope this was edifying mm -hmm. to a hopeful elect member. We want to give all praise, honor, and glory to the Hashem and Al Shai, the Hashem of the Hash. Double honors again to the apostles of Elder Great Mills, Strong Who Will, and safety to all the Akim out there pushing the truth into serious. Shalom. Shalom, man. Kwame Yashwala. Shalom. Shalom.